All right, hello, this is Marie Diaries. Welcome back to my channel. So I'm just going to try to do a quick little reading. So you may have been getting, um, or like, you know, within the last 48 hours, you may have got a call from an own, a unknown number, an unknown saved number. So I wanted to just see, I can pick up the energy to see what that was about so the cards that came out first was not the nine of pentacles the four of cups and the four of swords so i feel like somebody could be in some kind of um i'm thinking distressed over something yeah something because you got the ace of swords and the seven of uh, swords that just came out so somebody could be in some kind of distress over something Maybe something being revealed or something coming to the light or something that they could be in their head about. Um, maybe even make having them feel like, you know, feeling some kind of, uh, someone that want to be in control or something with this, um, because they don't want to feel like, uh, you got the five of swords, the two of wands and the king of swords. So I feel like this could be the energy of a masculine. Doesn't necessarily have to be. It could be a masculine or a feminine. But somebody's definitely in distress about something. I feel like it's because um, this person can be calling you because um, you're not in communication with them. Or they want to communicate something. Maybe that they want to work on something. Yeah. The sun card again. So something that I just seen it earlier with the five of wands somebody wants some kind of fighting or something to come to an ending you got the death card and the five of wands so this is like what they want to yeah because maybe they want to share or they want to be in this energy of sharing um i mean it could be a masculine or it could be a feminine energy but this person could be calling you out of nowhere um and this definitely is a number that's not saved in your phone yeah, because you usually will know, like, um, you know, the numbers that's calling you. And, um, yeah, you got the Eight of Swords and the Judgment card. So, somebody is feeling like um, something about judgment. Somebody is feeling maybe um, all in their head and, like, um, really, sh like, stressed out or confused about something. Like, about you maybe not communicating them with them or them receiving some kind of judgment about something that you're not communicating with them or that they want to communicate with you and you're not communicating with them. So, they want to come in with this energy of this Knight of Swords. Like, want to try to come in and start some kind of fight. But you could be bringing that, you could be putting that to an ending with not even, like, answering the number. Yeah, because somebody definitely in this energy of the devil cards, you know, they coming in, they want to, you know, come in with this knight of swords, devil energy, somebody that's looking to, um, they want to communicate, but I don't know if it's for a good reason, because just like you got the four of cups, so they like, definitely like they're all in their head, and then in the four of swords, it's like, this could be having them in the energy of feeling like, um, not feeling so great not feeling so good with the four the four of cups and the four of swords but they definitely could be somebody who's single i mean they could be single or they could be doing good or doing kind of they could be doing good or whatever but um they definitely want to come in for yeah you got the seven of cups but they definitely want to come in because they feel like um maybe they could reap something from you know reaching you or being in contact with you yeah seven of cups now so you got the seven of pentacles and the seven of cups. You got the devil, the seven of pentacles, and the seven of cups. So it's like they want to come in because they want to communicate something, but it's like they're like they're indecisive, I feel like, about maybe how they feel or what they want to do or what they feel like they're gonna get out of communicating with you. Cause you definitely got this knight of swords energy out here. Maybe somebody else could have been placed a judgment on them about something. So now they're trying to come and give you that energy of them receiving some kind of judgment about something. Something that they feel like something was uh, per postponed or something was postponed. 
Ooh, you got all these cards that come on. What else for the energy of this reading right now? For this unknown safe number. This incoming unknown safe number. Calling for a while. So somebody feel like they want to hold on to something or they want to keep something together. Clarify that for a wands. Wow, yeah, you got the King of Wands that just turned over with the Two of Swords. Yeah, because they definitely could be in their head about something, um, about them trying to hold on to this relationship. Um, especially if you guys are not communicating. So they definitely could be using this as an attempt to um, like try to hold on to you or hold on to their feelings with you or something like that. Yeah, yeah, this could be what, you know, it's definitely something that you don't see coming or is some kind of hidden agenda or secrets to what they're trying to do. Or maybe they're just trying to get on the phone to argue with you about something so that you could get into some kind of argument about something. Oh, surrounding that moon card. What else? Clarify this four of wands, two of swords, and the king of wands. Anything else? Clarify the four of wands, the two of swords. And the king of wands you got the seven of, seven of wands so this person could be very stressed they could be stressed because you're not talking with them and they want to come in and like start some kind of fight and argue or whatever yeah because they could be feeling like you might have backstabbed them or they make they may be feeling like they're getting some kind of betrayal because you know something something didn't happen like they wanted it to or you not communicating with them so they're not getting something that they want or just not being able to um be in contact with you it could be causing them some kind of despair yeah you got something important such as a new job or a raise yeah maybe this has something to do with money or maybe they felt like they lost out on some kind of money let's see you got um wow you got all this stuff coming out about money you got money path it says a pathway a path with money is waiting for you to find it you got sunrise it says um new creativity ideas new adventures a fresh start you got the month of august you got force it says muddled unclear thinking so somebody definitely could have some unclear thinking i definitely feel like that with this four of cups and this four of swords they definitely can have some kind of unclear thinking with those and then you got purse it says pay attention to your finances but you this person may not may have not been paying attention to their finances and this is why they're calling because maybe they feel like you could help in some way and this could be stressing them out look shirt just turned over it says take care or there will be a loss of material wealth so yeah maybe this person could have lost some kind of money and this is why they're calling to see if, I don't know, maybe if you could help them in some kind of way or, I don't know. You got Spear. Spear, it says heartache over what you no longer have. Yeah, like I was saying, they could be in heartache because you're not communicating with them. Um, or they don't have, you know, the contact with, they don't have that contact with you like they used to or something like that. You got Carrot, it says opportunity or windfall. Maybe they feel like you could have came into some kind of money or something. Or, um, I don't know, maybe, maybe this is what they could be hearing. You got not, it says unsuccessful plan. Yeah, them calling was some kind of unsuccessful plan. It was an unsuccessful plan. You got rose, romance in the air. So, yeah, somebody could be, they could be um, a goal-oriented person. So, you could be have a, having a goal-oriented person who's coming in like this i feel like that could be the energy of somebody else somebody new well it says family wishes come true yeah something that you've been wishing could be coming true and this card ring oh yeah wow it says a marriage will take place either romantic or business so yeah you could be coming into some new things with money and a relationship I feel like because wow both of these came out rose rose and ring and this could be what this person is worried about or 
they could maybe they sense something because yeah something was definitely some kind of unsuccessful plan this person that's coming in this person is very goal oriented at you know the things that they participate in you got a hand that says in need of help assistance or guidance okay so yeah this person they definitely like i said they could have been in need of some kind of help or guidance or something something's going on as to why they're trying to reach you you got tiger doing something risky taking a chance yeah they could be this could be what the risk is them taking a chance to try to see if they can get in contact with you by calling from this unknown saved number clearly something that you want to have saved in your phone you got candles says you will be shown the way you got fair woman so something with this can have something to do with a fair woman it says dealings or relationship with a woman with blonde gray or white hair you got vase it says secret admirer so you could have it a secret admirer of some sort 